Now you can use Pictory to create PowerPoint videos and be able to turn them into PowerPoint courses for yourself. Now I'm going to be using a couple of AIs to be able to show you how to do this and it's super easy. Now, if you'd like to learn a little bit more about that, stick around to the end. Hey, I'm Henry and I'm from Product Creation Formula. Here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks to be able to help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that sounds interesting to you, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. All right, guys, let's go. Check it out. Now, first thing you're going to want to do is go over to PowerPoint. Now, if you have PowerPoint and you're paying for PowerPoint, then you can also go over here to the add-ins and add this particular area here to ChatGPT PowerPoints. Now, to do that, you go over here to add-ins, then go ChatGPT PowerPoint, and then just add that to it. It's pretty easy to do. When you find it, you just hit add, and then it brings it up here. Now I'm in the homepage section and as you can see, it is right there. Now, all you need to do is click on that and it brings this area here up. Now, what I would strongly suggest you do is create from topic and then you can tell it what you want it to do. Now, if you pay for this, which I think is something like $56 a year or something like that, so it's not overly expensive, you can then have it choose up to 20 slides. Otherwise, it will only let you do seven slides. Then what you can do, this one does up to 15 slides at the moment. So that's all this one does. So what you can do from here is give it the topic and tell it how many slides you want. And then it will create the slides for you. Now, of course, I added a few extra things in here as well. For example, this one here, which is a PNG. I think this one actually might be a little video. And if you go down here, this one here is a PNG. But outside that, this one unfortunately won't show up when it's plain, but that's okay. So I would just strongly suggest if you're going to be adding images and stuff like that of your own, don't use things like PNG because it just won't show up. All right, so what you can do is you get it to create the actual PowerPoint slides for you and add that all the way through to how many slides you want. In this particular case, 15 slides. Then once you've done that, you can save it to wherever you want. Then all you need to do is go over here to Pictory. Once you're in Pictory, you'll see that there's these areas here. And Pictory looks a little bit different these days, and that's okay. What we do is we click on this. Now what I need to do is I now need to close my PowerPoint off because it is going to make it hard if I don't. So I'll just save that to make sure everything's all saved the way I want it. Close that off. Then what I need to do is drag the file across to where I want it. Now I'm just going to grab this one and pop it straight into there. And what that's going to do is it's going to then create the video for you. Now, go generate video. And in just a few moments, it will create the video. So I'm going to pause the video. It'll even add a voiceover for you. Now, if you don't have, if you're like me and you're just the one time payment of the Pictory, you'll discover that it doesn't create really good voiceovers. It's because I bought this originally from AppSumo. It's going to create videos that have the basic voiceover, which means you're probably going to want to go to somewhere like TTS OpenAI to have it create the proper voiceover for you. And you can still do that. So in just a moment, as you can see, it's now preparing the video for you. And I might pause the video until it's finished. Welcome to our guide on editing PLR ebooks and content using AI tools like ChatGPT. Okay, yeah, so we're just going to pause it there. As you can see, you've got options here on how to download it. You know, you can edit it here at the storyboard or you can download it. Now, I would strongly suggest that you get yourself a text document like this one here. And just shrink that down for a minute. I'm going to just edit this in storyboard. And as you can see, it's got the storyboard here. Now it's using all the text that's here. Now this also added a little bit of extra stuff here as well. So you can copy that. So it's going to go here, go control C or go control C. Then we're going to be adding that to my text document. Then move down a couple of areas, go here, 
highlight over the top of that, Control A, then Control C, and just add this to it. Unless, of course, you already have the script that you've already placed in there, but there we are. Now, my suggestion would be just do that all the way through for every single frame until you get to the end. Now, I'm going to just pause the video while I finish this off. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab hold of about half of this, about halfway through. That'll do, copy that. And we're going to go over here to TTS OpenAI. I'm going to get rid of that. And we're going to place this straight into here. Hopefully it doesn't take up all the characters. No, it's only giving me 1400 characters. Now, of course, I'll be using Echo and we're going to hit Speech, Create Speech. Once it's finished doing that, now we're then going to save this in a folder somewhere and then we're going to stitch them together using Audacity. Now, Audacity is a free audio editor. And it looks just like this. You expand that up and you can add all your ones there. So I'm just going to pause this in a moment and then we're going to place this in a folder and then we'll add this to Pictory. I'll just pause the video while we're waiting. Okay, so this is what it sounds like. Welcome to our guide on editing PLR ebooks and content using AI tools like ChatGPT. Okay, to do that, all you need to do, do is download it. Now I'm going to create a folder first and then we're going to download it into that folder. Okay, so I'm just going to download this and save it to where I want it. Videos, we're going to call this one one. There we are, hit save. Now we're going to go get this one here, grab the last part here, grab the rest of that, and we're going to place that in here as well. And go Control A, Control V, and we're now going to create the last part of the slides. So let's go there. Now what you can also do is you can turn this into a PowerPoint course. And you can say, for example, turn it into a PLR videos if you want to, or you can sell it on places like JVZoo, ClickBank, or even Warrior Plus. And you can have that into an entire course if you want to. So in just a moment, you'll see this come up. I'm just going to pause the video once again. Also, for those of you who don't know, TTS OpenAI is actually a free voiceover. You can use it for free and it makes some of the most magnificent voiceovers. So let's just go check this out now that it's finished. Places you can use AI for to make money online. For example, digital marketing agencies can use ChatGPT to speed up their processes. There we go. And what we can do is now just download that to where we want it as well. And we'll just call this one number two. There we are. And because we now have that available, now let's get this. And we'll just grab these two from this particular folder that I have over here. Drag them over. We're going to place them here. Holding down the control key and using the roller on my mouse, I'm going to shrink that down so that I can grab that, butt that together. And then all I have to do is now export that as the audio to my computer. Find the folder I've got it in. And I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm just going to be all exporting that now. It'll only take a second or two. And then once we've got that exported to where we want it, shrink that down. Now let's go back over here to Pictory. And all we really need to do is go to the first slide, go here. And what we're going to do is we're going to upload a voiceover. Click on that. I'm just going to drag the audio that I want and put it straight in here. And in just a moment, it's going to ask us if we wanted to sync it to the entire audio. And that's where we're going to say, yes, we do. So I'll just pause it while it's waiting and thinking. Okay, so as you can see, audio PPT to Pictory. We're going to go apply to all, hit there where it's the drop down menu and go entire video. Click on that. And what that's going to do is it's going to then add the voiceover across the entire video so that it sounds far more natural and they're not using their crappy voiceover for the entire thing. Once it's done that, I'll also, because I don't like using Pictory music, what I'll do is I'll go in there and I'll also remove the music that it puts in as well. Welcome to our guide on editing PLR eBooks and content using AI tools like ChatGPT. This presentation will walk you through the process of leveraging AI to enhance and customize your digital publications. PLR, Private Label Rights eBooks are pre-written digital publications that you can modify and use as your own. 
They save time on content creation while providing customizable material for various uses. Using pre-written content saves valuable time and reduces costs associated with original content creation. There we go. And that's what I can do. It, it syncs it up with this and turns it into a beautiful little course that you can then sell online. So we can go here. I just remembered I'm going to have to remove, remove the background music. So we go here, background music. We go background music just there. That's right, we hit this. And we shall now remove the background music. That's better. Now we can download it. Here we are. You can add your own music to it as well if you want to. And of course, you're adding your own voiceover to it. So we'll pause the video until it has finished. Be right back. Okay, so now all we need to do now is just hit download and we can export it to wherever we want. We can also export the text if we want to. And of course, we're going to be doing that as AI PLR. So I know which particular video I'm looking at. And then I'll just go there and download it to where I want it. And they'll go into the same folder in which I created. And this way, I'm not confusing myself by having two of the same name. So that is how you turn PowerPoint slides into videos using Pictory. All right, guys, if you got some value out of this video, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. Hey, while you're at it, why not consider sharing and also leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this new uploading PowerPoint into Pictory and be able to create video courses with that. Also too, to let you know that right here, we have a video I believe you might like. Down here is a video YouTube thinks you might like. And right here, well, that's an image of my head. And if you click on that, you'll be able to subscribe. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. And bye for now.